Just want to do a quick video explaining how to embed a voice thread into a post because I know this some of us are using voice thread which is awesome um, and there is a way to actually embed the video into a post and it looks like some people have been having trouble with how to do that it's giving them kind of like uh, you know incoherent posts and stuff like that so let me show you how to do that so what we're talking about is something that looks like this so you want to do something where you actually put the video itself in the post rather than give a URL or something like that it's actually pretty easy to do and once you figure out how to do it it's quite easy but it's not completely self-explanatory so let me show you when uh, I'm gonna respond to a post actually that um, that someone else wrote so I want to reply but I want to do it with a voice thread. I just recorded my voice thread and I want to embed it into the post. So here's how I do it. I go to voice thread and I find the video. So it's actually this video right here. I want to go to share, which is right in the middle of the screen there. It's that arrow. And once I go to share, I'm going to go to basic. Once I go to basic, I can either get the link, the URL that people can click on, or I can get the embed code. This is what you want to do if you want to embed the video into the post itself. I'm going to copy embed code. So I click there, it's copied my embed code. I'm going to go back to my post. Think of it this way, the embed code is basically computer language for putting the video in there. But if I put the embed code here, you're going to see it's just going to give me some really incoherent stuff. Well, what you have to do in order for it to translate into a video is go to this HTML code view, which is on the right side here, HTML code view. And I'm going to put the HTML code, which is that random set of digits and numbers and letters and stuff like that, and I'm going to click update. Once I do that, now you'll see that this there's this little video thing showing up in my post. That's an indication that I have embedded the actual video. So now when you go to the video, it actually shows the video and sure enough, I can actually play the video in there. So I hope that gives you a good indication of what it takes to do the embed code. Again, think of it as a language. Once you get that embed code, the only way that, can, that, that Blackboard can read that is if you go to HTML viewer and put the embed code in there. Uh, I'll also put a document with the steps listed on there if you want to try it again. And once you figure out how to do it, it really is pretty easy.